The Walker Art Center ranks among the five most visited modern-slash-contemporary art museums in the United States and, together with the adjacent Minneapolis Sculpture Garden, attracts more than 700,000 visitors per year. One of the most celebrated art museums in the country, the Walker Art Center is known for its innovative presentations and acclaimed collections of contemporary art across the spectrum of the visual, performing, and media arts. Over the course of more than 100 years, the Walker has evolved from a privately held collection into an internationally recognized institution and civic resource. Founded in 1879 by lumber baron Thomas Barlow Walker, the Walker was established at its current location in 1927. Edward Larrabee Barnes award-winning building opened in 1971 and was expanded in 1984. The addition of a pioneering urban sculpture garden in 1988, and its subsequent expansion in 1992, created a new civic landmark for the Twin Cities. In 2005, the Walker opened an expanded building and green space designed by Herzog and Demurinat, combined with the adjacent Minneapolis Sculpture Garden, forms a 17-acre campus. I think the Walker is a little bit unusual because our founder, T.B. Walker, was a lumber baron, amassed a great deal of wealth over a relatively short period of time in the 1860s and 70s, and like many people of his generation and time, acquired art. And he was quite an avid collector. He collected all kinds of things, antiques, art, decorative objects. He was quite a philanthropist. In addition to acquiring art, one of the first things he did was he opened his home. He built a gallery on the side of his home, and he opened it to the public for free. So it was really one of the first public art galleries in, in this region. So when he founded the Walker, he had first opened his home, and then he wanted to gift the collection um, to the city and build a museum. And the city, it just, as these things go, sometimes you can't make a deal with a city government. <laughs> um, so he ended up just acquiring land, building the building himself, and um, building his own museum. 